I remember I started without a brunch book, and then my dad surprised me with a brunch cookbook. And I've made just about everything that my family would like in the brunch cookbook. That's a gift that keeps on giving. <laughs> the cookbook is. I'm planning on making crepes today. He really plays with all the different ingredients and timing and temperatures and it's like a great big chemistry experiment every time he makes it. Oh yes, he was little and uh, my mother taught him how to make eggs while she was here on a visit and uh, I was getting ready for work, came downstairs and I'm thinking where's Luke? <coughs> He's standing on a kitchen chair at the kitchen table, <laughs> just whipping up this, uh, you know, egg whites and yellows and all that kind of stuff. I spilled eggs all over the floor one morning. My mom was very happy about that. <laughs> I was very young at the time. <laughs> my mom hates eggs. My dad hates coffee, but my brother's fine with anything. For him, I can put whatever I want to on the omelet. Every time in middle school, though, that he broke the bone, they would pull him out of PE and they put him in hammock. And boy, has that paid off for us. fryer for many things and he also uses the mandolin it's called that can shred and do all kinds of fancy things with potatoes or whatever. So. Well, I was just thinking about his affogados which are coffee things that he makes with ice cream and such. I don't know that those are crazy though. Those are crazy good. <laughs> <laughs> we like putting whipped cream on our coffee too. Uh, it was September almost two years ago and we smelled these wonderful smells coming from our kitchen and sure enough it was Luke and he was making a whole smorgasbord of things for us, laying it out on the table, using our china. We just thought it was wonderful. We sat down and wondered, wow, this is great and everything tasted so good. Mm. And he treats us so wonderfully well, not just on Sunday brunches, but often and always. That's what made it interesting. <laughs> yeah. You know, because usually I'm used to 